I'm being forcibly removed from the building again of a public lobby, so. Sir, please, is there anything I can do, sir, please? Don't do this to my wife, man. You don't know what you're doing to my family, man. Please, I'm begging. I'm literally be Where am I going to put my feet? Sir, I'm begging you, please. Please. I didn't break the law. I'm not going to be found guilty of anything. This is a waste of time. If you guys want to know who I am, I'll tell you who I am. Okay. You want to know what I'm doing here? I'll tell you what I'm doing here. Please, sir, please don't make this thing in jail. I'm begging you. We're not criminals. They're going to make me sleep in jail. Why? Sir, please. Please. Dude, please. Sir, please. Oh, my God. On, don't do that to him. You he guys don't know what think. you're doing to me, man. Why? Today's video takes us to Toledo, Ohio, where we find our good friend Long Island Frauditor as he attempts to film inside the Department of Motor Vehicles and Title Agency. Oh my goodness. Sit back, watch, and <laughs> enjoy! Today we're at the Bureau of Motor Vehicles here in Toledo, Ohio. We are here today, as always, to peacefully exercise our First Amendment right to film in public and publicly accessible areas to promote transparency and accountability within our government and to ensure that our public servants respect our rights and treat us with respect. I'm lost. I really am. What does a First Amendment audit have to do with holding your public officials accountable? You think you're some kind of Mickey Spillane? You're some kind of undercover writer? What are you, Sean? The only thing I can see that you're doing is making a ton of money for yourself. I don't know, brother, but let's carry on. A few moments later. All right, guys, so as we walk in here, we have the License Agency, Ohio Bureau of Motor Vehicles. On the left here, we have the Title Bureau, Auto Title Department. More moments later. Are you talking to me, ma'am? Are you photographing? Excuse me? Yeah, I'm just taking some pictures and video. It's fine. You're not supposed to. Well, I'm not supposed to take any pictures and video here? Oh, nothing here. Why is that? It's against the law. It's against the law? Yes. Do you know what law that is? There's sensitive um, things in here that you have to put Sensitive information? Now, if you want a pamphlet or a booklet, you can take that, but you can't put it right in here. Oh, no, I definitely can. It's not against the law. Yes, it is. Yes, it is. No, no, it's not. Yes, it is. I'm telling you, it's not. And yes, respectfully, ma'am. <laughs> I'm trying to be good and respectful. Yeah, me too. Me too. But, but I can't let you. I can, I'm not allowed to let you do it anymore. Well, I, I, I see you when you came in. Yeah. And you didn't say anything. And you've been doing it. And I'm, you know what? Yeah. I didn't know, notice it until you stood there. I do apologize, ma'am, but you have to understand, this is a member of the press. He thinks that the First Amendment to our Constitution grants him powers to walk around with his potato cam and record everything he can see from public, especially in a public lobby. Oh, my goodness. Oh, until I was over there in the corner? Oh, okay. Yeah, no. So, may I know who you are? You work here? Yes. And your name? Jackie. Jackie. My name's Sean. I'm an independent journalist. I'm just working on a story here at the Ohio Bureau of Motor Vehicles. So. Go to the headquarters. Yeah, no. <laughs> maybe, maybe I will go to the headquarters, but for now I'm just checking out the field of. I'm sorry. Yeah. Yeah. No, I'm just. I know I'm not breaking the law. So respectfully. That's what we're told to do. That's inaccurate information, though, Jackie. That's inaccurate. Mm -hmm. Is this sign a law? Um, who are you, ma'am? I'm a manager. And your name? Kiera. Kiera? Yes. Yeah, it's it, just like I told your, your employees here, Kiera, it's not against the law. To I'm sorry, Kiera, but you're arguing with the moron. And there's no way he's going to stop recording unless the police come and lead him out of the building. And then he's still going to have a temper tantrum. Because that's what he does. He travels around the country. He's quite successful in what he does. I'll give him that. He has uh, 300,000 subscribers and almost as many views on each of his videos. 
but it doesn't make it right what he's doing. I'm so sorry. It's, it is. It's not it against. Right there, no phone. Yeah. yeah. No, this is a recording device. It's no, a phone. It's a phone. This is a recording a device. Okay, well then, I will call the cops. You could do whatever you want, okay. Kira. Thank you. You could do that. Hello? That's fine. Hopefully they'll educate you here today. Looks like the manager, Kira, is not too happy, but... We're just exercising our constitutional right. What are you doing? What are you doing? Hi. Hello. Yeah. What are you doing? Oh. Hello. Who are you? I'm the deputy register, but you can take that off me. But you're talking to me. Well, you know what? Can you hang up uh, for a second? Just hang up. Jackie, hang up. Hold on. Ma'am, can I get your name? Oh, dear me, Sean. It looks as though they're going to call 911 on you. But Sean's not going to leave. Let's get to the part where the police arrive and see if they do anything. Most likely not, but you never know. Five minutes later. Hi, ma'am. I'll come, I'll come closer and you can, and I can smile for you. Hold on. I want to make sure you get a go good picture of me. Okay. I'll stand still in a second. Oh, I got gotcha. you. Okay, I just want to make sure you, you got the picture all, all good. Taking a picture from far away, it's not going to do anything. Hey, ma'am, I thought you said you couldn't take any video in this in this uh, office. Seems a little bit uh, hypocritical of you to be taking pictures and video. No, I just got a picture so I can send it to the state. Oh, okay. That's fine. Might get some personal information. Alright guys, so it's getting a little crowded and noisy in here. We're going to be waiting for the uh, law enforcement officers outside. Oh look, who's outside? The very nice woman. Sean always talks about how he's gathering content for a story. Well, that's true in a way. He's gathering content for his lame YouTube channel. I'm telling you, man, that guy is well over half a million dollars. I tell you, that's a fact. But uh, we all know that he's doing this for clicks and views. He doesn't care anything about the First Amendment. He just found a niche. That's what he found. He found a niche that he can exploit and make money on. He's not really a true believer in the First Amendment. Yeah, convince me otherwise. A few moments later. Hey guys, how, how you doing? Um, yeah, I was just, I was filming inside. I was um, an independent journalist working on a story. Okay. You mind, can I just get your names and badge numbers, please? Yeah, no problem. You want me to write it down for you? Quick? No, just, it's fine. You oh, can just okay. tell me. West Fall 2838. And, and your name and badge numbers, sir? 42915. Okay, thank you. We can go so in there and talk to Yeah, you. sure. Go, go ahead. Go ahead. That's fine. Yeah, it's, a, it's, a, it's a public space, so it's not... Nothing. Yeah, so maybe you could just educate them on that. That'd be great, yeah, officers. We'll, we'll let them know. All right, thanks. I appreciate that. Yeah, they're here to educate you guys that there's no law against filming in public. You don't have to educate us. We know that we're not supposed to. You're not supposed to. No, 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 yeah. Th that's why the law enforcement officers are here, ma'am. That's all. I would like to ask Sean, who, by the way, spells his name S-E-A-N. I didn't make this mean. But I would like to ask Sean, uh, what makes him think that everybody wants or needs his education? What makes you think that, Sean? Well, I'd love to talk to this guy in person. Of course, he never shuts up, man. He's, he's one of those narcissistic sociopaths that thinks everything he says it revolves around the center of the universe. No doubt about it. Look at her getting an education. He's not in here for business. I understand that. But as far as the recording, he's able to do so. Okay. Thank you guys. I appreciate you coming out. You guys stay safe out there, okay? No problem. The walk of honor. See? Everybody got a good education today? Have a nice day.
And now you know for next time, man. Thank you so much. You have a great day, okay? You too. So what was the purpose of that bloody palaver? To educate people. Sean, you missed your calling in life. You should have been an educator. But as far as what you're doing now, you're a fool. If you enjoy watching idiots, imbeciles, and morons on my channel, please subscribe. <laughs> as always, thanks so much for stopping by. Cheers to that.